Hey Capricorn, I thought I'd be a little nosy today and find out what's coming up in love for you. So this is going to be for singles who are interested in love reading. All right, I'll go ahead and get started here. Spirit, give me a card representing the new love interest. Okay, Capricorn, I feel like there is someone who you may know that has gone through quite an ordeal with someone romantically lately. You know that they put up with way too much. I want to say that this person is uh, just coming out of a breakup, so be very careful, be guarded, okay? Yeah, they're definitely in recovery mode, um, but I do see that they are going to work hard at, you know, giving you... Uh, what you want out of the relationship in the future. So Capricorn, if you have someone who's a little, you know, broken right now, they might need some time to heal, but I feel like they might be worth the effort. So let me see how you feel about this person. Mm. Okay. I feel like the person that's coming towards you, you are thinking is not exactly what you want. I feel like you think that this person was definitely um, heavily involved with like a soulmate type connection and you're not quite sure if this is the right move for you. And I think that's a confirmation of that. So Capricorn, if you've been um, recently dating someone and you're kind of stuck in your head about, you know, this is going to actually work for you guys. I feel like both of you have a lot going on mentally. So just take your time, you know, um, good relationships take time. And I feel like, you know, you need to look at things from a different perspective where this person is concerned because they could actually be um, a good person for you, but you have to continue to think positive about your romantic situation. I feel like there's been too much instability in your relationships in the past. So it has you doubting everyone or that you'll ever find real love. Let me see. Um, does the person that they have interest in have other love interests? Is there anyone else in that person's ray of interest dating romantically? Okay. I feel like this person is currently working on their money. Um, they're still trying to work through the breakup and having to release all of that. And I feel like at this time, they're really not listening to their intuition regarding the healing process. So um, I want to say I don't get any indications of major player vibes, or I feel like this person is more so concerned about money. What about you? Are you currently seeing other people? Okay. It looks like you made a decision to release someone who was pretty toxic for you, or you're in the process of releasing someone who was probably not really good for your life. It feels like there was a lot of, you know, um, I want to say more like sneaky, lying, betrayal type energy from this person. I feel like you are trying to get rid of the last bits of residue from your last person. So if um, that made any sense, let me know, Capricorn. I thought I might, you know, be nosy and see what's going on. So the overall advice is stop being so negative about love. I really feel like you're mentally going to block yourself from good things. Um, and you know what? You're probably wondering why you always end up with people who need healing. And I'm going to just say this. We all need healing. Every single one of us. So don't, you know, go, oh gosh, another project person. It might be a really solid person. It's just everybody goes through hard times sometimes. So, cheer up, love. Be positive. Love is around the corner. Stop being so blue about it. It's right around the corner. All right, Capricorn.
Love ya.